No more booty, we'll get more booty, it's okay. There's, al there's always more booty. If that was planned, I really like this level creator. I wonder if I could spaghetti wildly. Get that cheese out of here, motherfuckers! <laughs> what the fuck?! No, dude! Ben? Ben looks like he makes some good puzzles. Go- go fucking Australia, let's go- Dude, calm like a bob -omb. Dude, this- 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 these- <laughs> These fucking names, yo. Um, the escape artist puzzle is the puzzle that Sean recommended to me. The escape artist puzzle by Ben. Forewarning, my brain is gonna be dead. My brain is officially fried. I, I don't understand how people stream for like 12 hours straight. After like three or four hours, my brain is just fucking fried. And what better way to, what better way to do a puzzle than when your brain is fried? Can I get through this? Oh, oh, I got a boot. I got a boot, I got a vine. It wasn't a divine. Oh, clearly I'm solving the puzzle. Yeah, then we get this, and then we go through here. Yo, easy, easy every time, first try. And then we put this thing on, and then we quickly go back through the P-switch door, because now I can activate this, because I got the thing, and then we do that, and then it hits the POW, and the POW blows shit up, and then we won! No, I don't know what the fuck we're doing. Alright, um... Not else to do here. Somehow we're gonna be able to get through this door, but how? I don't know. I'll come back to that later. What's in this door? Do, 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 do. All right. Uh, looks like she was there. Something I can do over here. Hold on. Let me just look at this for a second. Those blocks kind of jump off there. I don't know what those do. Yeah, I can't get out of here. I don't know how I could get out of here either. All right. Not the way to go. What's the? How did that bomb? Where did that bomb come from? And why was that bomb not there before? <laughs> oh shit. Well, that was what we were supposed to do apparently. I could go back over here and get another boot, which would give me another P-switch. Hold on, wait. So we can do this, we can hit that, this thing goes up, and then that thing spits out a P-switch. There's a red coin up there. I don't know how we're gonna... Oh. Oh. Oh yeah, so I did solve the puzzle without knowing what I was doing last time. <laughs> Yo, we're solving the puzzle and we don't even fucking know how, once again. And now there's a pal that's loose up there. Clearly I'm still solving the puzzle and don't know how. I somehow need to blow up the cannon? Yeah, I need to blow up the block below the cannon. I don't know how I'm gonna get a bomb there though. Maybe we'll think about that later. Dude, and this... This fucking... But that pal's not gonna blow up though. Okay, let's go back to where we were before because that looked interesting. So let's lower this. And then let's hit this guy, jump up here, get another P-switch. Also, we can think like, hey, can we do something with this P-switch? Remember, it doesn't be one, so I can't pick up items. Whoopsies, I should be here. Yeah, all right, there we go. Let's go back in here. It's kind of interesting. Like, I wonder if I could... <laughs> wonder if I could spaghetti wildly. I think I've got an idea. Yeah, yeah, actually... Okay, wait, 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 wait. wait. I got an idea. <laughs> Obviously that's what you're supposed to do. Here, wait, here's my idea, my brilliant plan. My master plan is now that I've like blown that section up, this bomb comes out of here. Check this out, if I were to juggle this bomb uh, up into that top area, theoretically I could get the bomb into this spot right, oh shit, into the spot below that cannon, and then the launcher would actually fall down I think. There might be an easy way to do that, though. I don't know. I don't fucking know. This level's pretty sick. Oh, I'm an idiot. I forgot to do the thing. I forgot to do the thing! Ugh! We gotta lower the thing first! <laughs> Girl, you already spaghetti wildly. I know, I don't need- we don't need anything else- we don't need anything else helping me, okay? <laughs> Plus side, I think I got this down. We lower that. Die. Yeah, this is Super Mario Bros. 1 style, meaning I cannot pick up any of the items. So yeah, be careful about that. Alright, this is what we do. A plus, easy every time. Go in the door. Grab the thing. Bag in the door. Light the bomb. Hit this in the air so it doesn't get blown up by the pow. <laughs> I don't know if that's gonna do anything useful for me. What's an what's an easy way to get the bomb up into this spot up here? Like, is the crazy ass juggle strat really the way to do it? Doesn't that seem like kind of bullshit trying to get it to go up in there? Part of me wonders like what is an easier way that we can do that? So a couple other things we can do. We can do what we did before. 
how this bomb will actually destroy that, which is going to spawn a pow, but I actually don't understand what spawning that pow does for me. I mean, I guess it's the key, which is nice. I think maybe the level creator just put it there to have something there. But in order to go through the door, see this part right here, we have to put a- imagine a bomb where where Mario is standing right now. If there were a bomb right here, it would blow up the block underneath the launcher, the launcher would fall, and then I can use my key to go in that key door. Oh wait, am I doing this backwards? God, I'm a fucking idiot. I can go in the other key door. <laughs> I'm a fucking idiot! There's another- There's another key door! Alright. We're overcomplicating things. Let's do that, do this, get the P-switch. Alright, gotta do this door. Dude, we can just go through this fucking... We can just go through this. What do I do? What did any of that do for me? That did nothing! That did nothing! What was the point of that? Here, I got- I got another question. I got another question that needs answering. That was like, a good idea that then went in nowhere. Alright, there's one more thing I want to test. I wonder if it's possible for me to get up here. Uh, looks like no. I was thinking maybe it was possible to get up here, but it does not appear to be the case. I also can't get through there. This <laughs> is... Lovely. Yo, fucking cheese! Get that cheese out of here, motherfuckers! <laughs> okay, I'm pretty sure that that was cheese. I don't know though. Pretty sure that was cheese. That felt like cheese. <laughs> that felt like delicious, delicious cheese. So what do we do next though? Like, that, that got me a coin, and maybe I wasn't supposed to have that coin, but did that actually help me? What's your opinion of Overwatch? I've never played it. it looks like a really fun game though. I honestly, Blizzard has like never made a game that I didn't like. I feel like we fucked something up, but I don't know what. Like, I'm not sure what else to even do other than try to juggle the bomb. Let me just, um... Okay, if I go back through that door... I, I need to get the spike helmet, I feel like. But how do I get the spike helmet? Oh, I got an idea how to get this coin. Here, I, I got one more just little, little thing to try right here. What if we do this? What if we go back into this area? Overwatch, toxic kids ever. Yeah, it seems like that's the problem. Is the problem with a lot of these games? Like the game isn't bad. It's just the environment is bad. All right, here's my question. Uh, I think that I can actually do that. All right, check this out. This is like this is a weird idea. That was not at all what I wanted to do. My idea was if I get the bomb on top of that, then I can actually kick the bomb to the right into that into that one, into that red coin up there. Huh, maybe that is the way to do it. That's actually pretty easy to do. Interesting. So I think I can get that red coin, but that still doesn't really help me because getting these red coins is like, not gonna help me in the long term. Yo, Glitch Cat, how's it going, man? I don't know the exact best way to go about doing that anyway. See, like, this, looks, this setup looks a little bit tricky, so I can't help but wonder if this isn't like, really the right way to do this. Yeah, I don't- I can't ever really kick it right. So what I was trying to do is get on here with the bomb somehow, which would be a little tricky. Oh, the, this doesn't go high enough anyway. I can never kick it that high. It doesn't go high enough anyway. Okay, well, I think I fucked something up. Yeah, I think I fucked something up. Alright, I'm gonna restart because I feel like I'm missing something. I don't even see where to even theoretically go. Dude, I don't think that helped. <laughs> I don't think that helped! Uh, Alright, get the boot, use the boot to hit the thing. When we use the boot to hit the thing, it makes the P-switch. P-switch lets us go through the door. Going through the door lets us get that. Oh, there are a bunch of coins, huh? So... Okay, by letting the P-switch wear off, now we're getting all of the coins to stay as blocks. And if the coins stay as blocks, I don't know what to do with them because this one doesn't look like it's gonna really do- Oh, actually, wait, I do have an idea for what that one could do. No, not really, the cannon's in the way. Dude, how do you- Alright, wait, so we can get this one. I think I need to just reset this here. Yeah, but what if we go back to the key door again? Uh, so that gets us the key, and the key does let us go through the door. Here, wait, so let's lower this again, get another P-switch again. Use the P-switch to go back through- Use the P-switch to go through here. I still wonder what else we can maybe do with that bomb, but... So this lets us go back- Oh, I should have waited for the P-switch to wear off. I should have waited for the P-switch to wear off. Fuck, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. But how would that have helped? Like, would that have actually helped? If I waited for the P-switch to wear off, then there would be a coin below this door. But what's that gonna do for me? 
And what else can I do in this section? I need a sp I need the spike helmet. But how can I get the spike helmet? How can I move these? Oh, did that was that a thing that was a thing that's worth doing? How do I get the spike helmet? Maybe if I had maybe I need to lose my hat or something like that. <laughs> yeah, let's um let's try not fucking up the uh Oh, there is a block over there. So if you look underneath the uh, underneath the spike helmet, there's a block. So we need to make sure that we don't accidentally destroy that block. I think that's the problem. And then once we get the spike helmet, I feel like we can make we can actually do other stuffy stuffs. Yeah, I wanna I wanna go down here and wait, huh? How do I get the? Okay, yeah, the block will come back. This should be fine still, right? And then when I when I reset, the block will be there, right? Yeah, yeah, so now the block is under the spike helmet. All right, this is good. This is really good. So this is what we need to do. I'm gonna just go ahead and let that one blow that up to get the key. Yeah, okay. We'll go through here. We want to take our sweet time. Okay, now we've got all the blocks activated. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So now, how do I actually get the spike? <laughs> I just destroy it, right? So I, I think I just... Hold on, wait. Let me get that donut to respawn. I think I'm just gonna destroy this block, hit this, get that. There we go, there's the fucking spike helmet. All right, all right, all right, now we're making some progress. Now we're making some progress. All right, so what can we do differently with the spike helmet? We can do a bunch of stuff. First off, we can get that red coin in that room we just came from. Oh, this is how you destroy that. You don't juggle a bomb up into this. You just fucking do that. What the fuck? No, dude. That was bullshit, man. The fucking midair fired the P switch like RNG right onto my fucking head. What were the odds of that happening? Are you fucking kidding me? If that was planned, I really. If that was planned, I really like this level creator. If that wasn't planned, this level creator's garbage. <laughs> Alright, we gotta come back. We gotta get that key first because that key's gonna actually let us go into the door right here. Yeah. And then we wait. We have to wait to go through this door until the piece which timer runs out or else the cannon will spawn underneath the shell on the top right. Okay, so we wait here and then we do this. This lets us get the spike helmet. Okay, that gets the spike helmet. And then we can fucking get stuff done. Now there's a bunch of coins that I can get. I feel like I should just kind of get them. Let's lower this. Let's see if we can do this again with like 9,000% less sucking. Okay. <laughs> And I think I should, I think I should just go up here and get that. Oh, fuck my life. <laughs> fuck my life. Uh, I should be okay. Maybe. Possibly. I should be able to get the spike helmet again. Oh, uh, nope, I'm never gonna get the spike helmet again. Do I need the spike helmet again? That's the question. That is the question that I have. Oh, I totally see how to get that other red coin. I totally see it. I got an eye. Oh, yeah, I needed the spike helmet. Yes, I needed, and I see why. I needed the spike helmet. I see exactly why. We get, we need, we need to get two more coins with the spike helmet. I think this level is really an interesting puzzle. Like the puzzle has like multiple different layers on it of going back and forth between the same sections and doing different things in them, which is really neat. So it's like cramming a lot of material into one level. I've looked at all the coins on the level, and I think I get how to get all the coins. This is a great puzzle. These puzzles are all really. Have all been really good from Ben so far. We might have to- Dude, he's got like 30 Nigma Chronicles. That's, that's intriguing. It's very much intriguing. As soon as the piece switch wears off, then we can go through here so we can get the spike helmet. And then now I'm gonna try to get like two or three coins with the spike helmet. Just to make sure that I actually understand how to get these freaking things. Alright, switch up our helmet game. Alright, what do you think about the new movie Life? Uh, finding malicious life on Mars. Do you think there's life on Mars? I've, I've seen the like trailer for it, but I don't really know much to comment about it. Like I love sci-fi movies, so I'm definitely interested. But do I think there's life on Mars? Probably not. Maybe there's microbial life, or maybe there was life in the past that then died. Or maybe there's life, microbial life, from Earth. That like, an asteroid hit the Earth, knocked off a chunk of the Earth, and it like, fucking hit Mars or something. Now, or even from one of our spacecraft or something, and there's like, contaminated it with life. But those are the only things that... Really, dude, that that is that thing was fucking coming for me. All right, let's get this one. What's the plan here? I kind of want to get back to that initial or to that right side section. I think I'll try to do that. Oh, 
How am I gonna hit the P-Switch now? Can I have a P-Switch, please? Hey, wait, I want- Oh, I can get the boot out of here! Oh my god, I didn't even- I didn't even consider this, I can get the fucking boot out of here. Oh, I'm an idiot. Hooray, I'm an idiot. I should totally get that boot, though. Oh, I thought I understood this and I didn't. I thought I understood it and I don't understand it. The, the strategy that I had involved... See, this shell right here, right above me, if I were to access this area before the P-Switch were active, like, let me just go through this door and show you what I mean. Um, look at that shell. So that shell's actually on top of the block, right, right next to me here. If that shell's on top of the block, if I were able to get my way up there, like, by riding... Woo! By, like, riding this POW block up here, um, jumping up here to destroy this guy, and then if I hit the shell, the shell would go blah, 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 bounce back and forth here and collect this red coin. So that was the way that I thought of to get that red coin, but I don't understand how to get to this area with the shell still there. That doesn't make sense to me anymore, because there's no way for me to get to... Unless I can kill, like, kill this muncher from below or something. I don't think so. Well, there goes my hopes and dreams. I don't know how to get that last red coin that's, like, right on top of the goal. That's the only big issue that I have right here. Oh, I get it. I have to... If I come back through the key door, then I'll be on the right side in the right spot. That's totally it. That's gotta be it. Okay. Alright. Let me get the... Let me get the other one first here, too. Also, I want to get the boot real quick. Let me get... Oh, shit. Alright, I think I got an idea here. I think I got a really good idea. Alright, if this trolls me, I'm gonna be mad. Alright. Yeah, this is... I think this is actually what I want. Yeah, now I got the boot, which is nice. Yeah, this, this is actually fine for this part. I actually want to hit the pal block. Yeah, this should be fine, though, because I can jump up here and jump up here and then see, look, I can get this red coin that way. Okay, good, good, good. Oh, we're, I think we fucking got this. All right. So now we need to... We need to hit the P-switch one more time, go back through the P-door. Yeah, 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 I think I got this. My P-switch. So let's go back through the P-switch door here. Wait for the timer to run out, then go back through the key door that we were going through before, because now I can get to the red coin in the top right part of the screen. I think I got that. I think I got this. Alright, now we go through this. Yeah, yeah. And then we can kill this thing. Get this coin. Very nice, very nice. Okay. I got to ditch my boot here. Oh well. Oh, no more booty. No more booty. We'll get more booty. It's okay. There's, al there's always more booty. All right, I want to make sure I don't fuck this up. I'm running out of time here, but I think I got it. I think all we're gonna do is, yeah, we get the boot, go back, do exactly what we just did, except go back through that door. And that, I think, is gonna work for us. Okay. Kill the dude, go here, wait for the timer to run out because the coin underneath the door- Oh! That's why this coin is here. That's why the coin underneath this door is right there. If I had not had that here, I wouldn't have been able to go through the door right now. So now I think this should work. We're gonna go back through this door and then just immediately go back. Fuck, it didn't work! Fuck! Shit, that was my- wait, I can still- no, I can't. Maybe if I hold left? Shit, it didn't work. I wonder if it would work if I held left, though. Shit, that was my plan! That was my plan! Oh, there is a coin behind the wiggler, isn't there? Oh fuck, how do we get that? It's all over. <laughs> Dream is dead! Dream is fucking dead! Boots can walk on spikes. Oh hey, Boots can walk on spikes! Oh hey look, I'm an idiot! <laughs> I TOLD YOU I WAS TIRED! I TOLD YOU I WAS TIRED! I TOLD YOU I WAS TIRED! That is... that is indeed the case. Boots... Boots can walk on spikes. Boots can walk on spikes. <laughs> We're puzzling good! Real good. Real good. Real good. We're running out of time. We're running out of time. We're running out of time. Alright, we gotta fucking get this done. I still don't get how to get the coin underneath the wiggler, though. I need to kill the wiggler. I need to... Hold on, wait. Right? Don't I actually... Oh, shit, I didn't do it in time. Don't I actually need to destroy that coin now? Now I need to destroy that coin, right? Shit, we're running out of time, running out of time, running out of time, running out of time. We're running out of time! Okay, we gotta blow up the coins now. This actually- Okay, wait, wait, we gotta do this fast. Blow that, go back, go back here again. I right, we fucking got this. Fucking got this! Please, mama! No spaghetti! Get the coin, go back through here. Now that we're back through here, we can fucking- Oh, I... Wrong order. 
Wrong order! I had to do it second, and I had to do it second, and then I had to hit the thing and do it from there. And do it from there. It's over. The dream is dead. The dream. <laughs> On the plus side, now we can do the whole puzzle from the top now that we actually know what the fuck we're doing. So, first step, get the P-switch. Use the P-switch to get the helmet. While the P-switch is still active, we can use the P-switch door to go in here to kill the bomb, but we gotta be careful because if we hit that bomb too soon, it destroys all the coins. And as it turns out, you need to have most of the coins active, especially this one fucking above this thing, or you get screwed! So, I'm gonna actually just reset right here because we need to get the key now. Before we can go in the key door, we have to actually get the first key. First key we get from letting the bomb, which is now freed because we blew up the block that was holding him in. Fucking put this guy over here, whatever, that's just over. Yeah. To get the first key. So that gives us first key. Using first key, we go back through the P-switch. And we can now, the POW is bouncing up and down. Now that we got the key, we can go on top of that to go in there. But we have to wait in order for the P-switch timer to wear off because the spike helmet has a block below it, or a coin below it. And if that coin is not a block, then we're not going to be able to jump up here and get it because it'd be a cannon in the way. He overlapped a block of the cannon on the turn block. Okay, now we got the helmet. What do we do with the helmet? So we do like six things. God, this level has a lot of steps. So it's got passed. So first thing we can do is we can get the boot. So we can break this block. Now this shit falls. Dude, this level is a fucking troll. Luckily that's okay, that's okay. That's fucking fine. <laughs> that's fucking fine. We get the coin in the top left. We gotta get all the other coins first. Yeah, we got, so I have to get the Wiggler coin last, huh? Alright, get the boot round two with less sucking. Okay, now that we got the boot, I think, yeah, we gotta go through here, but we gotta wait. I can kill this, yeah, I can, oh wait, I can't do that part yet, yeah, without hitting the, okay, yeah, wait, I wanna hit the pow right now, yeah, it's, I'm free to hit the pow, okay. So, I'm using the pow because it destroys the munchers in the top left. And if I destroy the munchers in the top left, then I can come over here and go in there and get that thing. Alright. Now we gotta do one more time. Hit the P-switch again. Now we're gonna get the coin in the top right. So... We go through here, we wait... Do we wanna wait for the... Does it really matter if we wait for the P-switch this time? I'm not sure if it really matters. Oh, I might collect the coin, so let's wait anyway. Okay. Now we're gonna go through here. Now we can go up here, get this one. And at the same time, we can go down here and we can break these blocks. So this is gonna allow us to go back the next time we come back there. Okay, okay. We fucking got this. We fucking got this. Don't pow, don't pow the co door coin. Just go through with piece active. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got, I got it. I got it. I got it. I'm on top of it, guys. Please. You, obviously, you have you have so much reason to trust me on this. All right, I got this. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I think we're just gonna hit the P switch, go through this thing. Oh, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, bro! Okay, we're just gonna go through this door while the piece which is active, because now we want- Fuck you! We want the coin underneath the wiggler to be a coin. Boom! Because then we get to kill that. But then we then we get this coin here, but then we wait for the piece which timer to run out. Go back through here with the piece which timer running out. The shell spawns up there with the fucking shell up there. Do I want- I think I need to drop my boot. Yeah, I need to drop my boot or I would kill this. Well, I don't think it really matters at this point. Doesn't matter at this point. I don't fucking know. All right, that's gonna get the last fucking red coin. Oh, now that hits that. Oh, that's so nice. That's why the pow's there. That's why the fucking. That's why the fucking pow is there, man. That's why the fucking pow is there. Okay, we just go through the door and win? Question mark. Am I missing something? <laughs> Do we just. Don't we just go through the door and win? All right. If we don't win, I don't know what's going on. I'm pretty sure we win. Alright. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Really, really nice puzzle. This is a really excellent puzzle. Damn, that that puzzle packed a ton into one screen. Hot damn. Got the booty. Yep, always, always get the booty. Really fun level. Yeah, we have to definitely check out some more of Ben's puzzle. He makes some good stuff for sure. Thanks to Sean for recommending that one. The little Hylian donated $1.69 says, Mobile didn't attach the message to my resub. Oh, okay, so he wanted to say, love you, man. Well, love you too. 
Um, can't wait to meet you at SGDQ. Yes, hopefully. Oh my god, I'm so excited, but I'm also so scared. Uh, the We will know the SGDQ games in another three weeks. We gotta wait, gotta wait three more weeks to know if Mario Maker gets in, but I'll be going to SGDQ in either case. Um, thanks to you, I met so many great people that I can call friends. Carla, well, thank you so much, Little Highland. And I am very happy to have met you as well. Have a, have a heart, buddy. J10Gaming, $21, says, Ever had a root canal done? Ooh, no, I haven't. Very glad that I have not. Uh, I'm getting one done on Monday, and I'm afraid it'll hurt. Well, I know many people who've gotten one, and they did not have any pain at all, like, from the procedure itself. You know, those... Dude, we are... How lucky are we to be living in... In an age with fucking anesthesia and painkillers. Like, god fucking damn. Like, I mean, I've had a bunch of um, tooth stuff done. You know, and they just, like, it kind of hurt stings for a second if they, when they inject something into you or whatever, but then everything just goes numb and you can't, can't hurt anything. Uh, yeah, Angel says, didn't hurt. It doesn't hurt. It just feels crazy weird. Yeah, that's the same thing that I've heard, too. But, like, how fucking lucky are we that we live in a world where we can just inject some shit and not have to, not have to feel, <laughs> not have to feel pain. Uh, Killacall says, says, I had four root canals and they didn't hurt. I believe, I believe, every day's a good day when you paint. I believe, I believe, it'll bring a lot of good thoughts to your heart.